Jesus is not enough. There's a story of a Christian band that was at a concert and they asked all of the concert goers, what is your denomination? And asked them to say it at the same time. And of course, it sounded just like a jumbled mess of noise because everyone was saying a different denomination. Then the lead singer said, now say Jesus. And everyone said in unison, Jesus. And it sounded really nice. Is just knowing the person Jesus really enough? You see, what matters is how you believe and what you believe about that Jesus. Is that Jesus really God? Or is he just a madman saying that he is God? Is he telling the truth or is he a pathological liar? Did he really exist from eternity past or did he have a beginning? You see, all of those questions matter. There used to be a song back in the 90s that said, I don't care who you are, where you're from, I don't care what you did, as long as you love me. Now, that sounds great and romantic, but is that really true? Is that a smart way to approach a relationship? Wouldn't you want to know, regardless of that, whether that person loved you, if they were a murderer? Wouldn't you want to know if that person was a liar or a con artist? What if that person was a sexual predator? But you said it didn't matter to me because that person loves me. No, those questions matter. How you believe about Jesus makes a difference. That being said, we cannot then just create a Jesus we like. We need to find out who that person is. Creating a narrative about the person you love is just gonna cause you to be delusional. You need to find out who that person actually is. We live in a world now where people want to create God and not find God. And the Bible warns us of this in 2 Timothy 4.3. The whole point of the Bible is to tell us the truth about God. Do you care about that truth? If so, it will cause you to have what we call doctrine. It will cause you to have beliefs about that God. And a belief of an eternally burning hell versus a hell that has an ending makes a difference about who that God is. The belief about a God who's simply arbitrary and asks people to obey Him out of sheer force versus a God who seeks voluntary service of love makes a difference. Don't allow yourself to be swooned into this idea that doctrine doesn't matter. Find the truth in the Bible yourself. Search it. Mine for it. As the Bible says, seek and you shall find. Doctrine matters. What do you think?